So this video was supposed to be made back in September when I just reached 10,000 subscribers and this was going to be the big celebration video where I said thank you to everybody for making this happen and we did a bunch of cool stuff like a contest and all that but a lot of stuff has happened since then with school and work and getting sick and now I'm at like 12 and a half thousand subscribers so it's just not going to be the same. But it's still pretty cool. Hey everyone, it's David, and I wanted to start this video off right by saying thank you to everyone who's helped me reach this huge milestone in my time here on YouTube. I wouldn't be making videos if people didn't watch them, so thank you, thank you, thank you for all the support. So when I reached my 10,000 subscriber back in September, I started to think about why I was posting videos to begin with. And I thought back to when I first discovered YouTube in 2006. One of the first things I searched for were Ocarina videos because uh, I was just getting back into Ocarinas after uh, a large, long break of not playing any. And I was kind of sad to see that the only videos I could find were of people who had just bought an Ocarina and were playing some Zelda songs. My only problem with that was that they were treating the Ocarina more like a toy or a collector's item than an actual musical instrument. So my ultimate goal with posting videos was to show people that the Ocarina was capable of so much more and that it deserved a lot more appreciation than what it was getting. And on that note, I'd like to invite all my subscribers to do the same. Over the next two months, I'll be holding a special competition exclusively for my subscribers to not only win your choice of a brand new transverse, pendant, or inline ocarina, but also to help in spreading ocarina awareness, which is helping everyone to understand that the ocarina is more than a toy from a video game, or a collector's item, or even a novelty gift for a child, but that it's a serious instrument that deserves some appreciation. So for more information, you can click the link here or in the description box and it'll take you to a group where you can post your videos after you read all the rules and stuff so check it out if you are interested. And speaking of it being a toy from a video game for those of you who don't know next month November 21st is actually the 10th anniversary of The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time and now I feel old. It was through this video game that I came to discover the ocarina to begin with and now it's one of my favorite musical instruments so I wanted to celebrate it right and the first thing I'm going to do is make a special music video and that's going to be a surprise but I did want all my viewers to participate in a collaboration video which is going to be a series of questions that I'd like you to answer and then you can submit those videos as video responses and I'll mash them all together and I'll post it on my channel and then you'll become famous. Okay, maybe not. So if you'd like to participate in that one, you can click here again, or you can click in the description. And finally, I'm working on another special project in the near future, which I'm going to announce pretty soon. But I first needed to know where all my viewers are around the world, specifically in the United States, but it would help to know where my viewers are in other countries. So um, there's another link in the description. There's a lot of those, I know. Um, you can click it there, and I just need you to uh, follow the instructions about how to put yourself on the Google map and then it'll help me to better plan for this special project that, that'll be coming up pretty soon. So if you can help me with that, I'd really appreciate it. Well, that's pretty much it for this video. And the last thing I wanted to mention is, as many of you know, the US financial system is in a bit of a crisis right now. And the people who are taking the biggest hits are the small businesses, especially our ocarina makers. And um, I just wanted to make a request that if anyone is considering making an ocarina purchase in the near future or is saving up for one, that you would consider purchasing a U.S. ocarina from one of our small makers. And just a couple companies that are out there are like uh, Mountain Ocarinas, uh, Hind Ocarinas, um, Songbird Ocarinas, Clay's, I think Clay's in this Whistleworks, and you have Whistleworks. And these aren't huge companies, these are two or three people who make ocarinas for a living. And this is where their money comes from, so if you have a request for a review, uh, let me know. I'm saving up for a few ocarinas, but I, I don't have a lot of money right now, so if you'd like to help in purchasing these ocarinas that I'm, I'm hoping to review pretty soon, um, let me know, send me an email if you'd like to help donate some money towards that, or if you have any questions about any ocarinas from our US makers, you can send me an email and I'll do my best to uh, answer your question or forward you to um, those people's emails so you can get your questions answered and hopefully get a brand new ocarina in your pocket. So I'd just like to say thank you to everyone who supports my videos 
which is supporting these ocarina makers in turn and the ocarina in general. So thank you very much for um, subscribing, for rating, for commenting, and for getting the word out about the ocarina. And I hope that um, if you don't have an ocarina already, hopefully you'll have one soon from one of our U.S. makers. And um, you'll continue in supporting ocarina awareness. So thank you again to everyone who's helped me reach uh, over 10,000 subscribers. And I uh, hope you'll continue to enjoy my brand new videos. And um, hopefully I'll see you soon. Thank you.